Hello and welcome to the guide for the energy efficiency design summary. So you'll notice that there are three parts to this form, beginning with the project information where you can enter the address as well as the building information and lastly the contact information for billing purposes and how we will send the EADS form to you. So to begin please put in the address and be as specific as possible and then you'll notice there's a selection for new build, retrofit, and if you're giving us some hand-drawn schematics, uh, here's some minimum measurements that we'll need, including the window sizes. And then lastly, in addition, in the case that you'd like a needs form for that. For a new build, there's an option where you can upload PDF drawings. And you can attach more than one if you need. And then you can also submit more than one EADS request right now as well, if you're doing a number of projects right now. So here is a place to select uh, which zone you would be considered in by the Ontario Building Code. So Zone 2 is Northern Ontario, Zone 1 being Southern Ontario. So for our example here, we'll stick to the Southern Ontario. And for heating fuel source, you can select natural gas, for example. And you'll notice this orange button here is a, is a selector for your compliance package. So this is nothing written in stone but it's just if you already know some of the specifications it will help uh, narrow down a uh, search for a compliance package that works so for example say you're using natural gas and it's a 90 percent efficient furnace and you have r24 in your above grade walls and you are installing an hrv so that would be uh, very close to compliance package e so there are other options that you could have. So to take a look, you can see them here, but the vertical column here for E uh, matches those values already. So going back to our form here, if we were to select E, and then for your windows, if you know the U value, you can put that in, otherwise you can leave it unknown. And if you haven't already inputted your R values, there's a place to do so here. And lastly, we just need your billing contacts and um, the address that we could mail this to if we needed to. And an email address to send to. If you'd like us to call you, uh, you can put in a phone number here, preferably with a name. This can be yourself or someone, say, like an architect. And then lastly, how you'd like to receive the EADS form itself. If you have any additional comments, and then here is a place for you to, say, send a quote um, or ask us to send a quote, uh, or if you already are familiar with our pricing, we can just start right with the project already. And that's all there is to that. Thank you for working with Design Experts.